War Diary Day 511 of Russia's War Against Ukraine. After the Kerch Bridge uh, road connection was broken, almost certainly by the Ukrainians, but they haven't confirmed that, the Russians have said we're no longer taking part in the grain deal. This is an agreement that Ukrainian grain in ships can move out of the ports they've got control of, principally Odessa, and uh, can go through the Black Sea um, and now with Turkish permission to the wider world. This grain keeps Africa and the whole chunk of the Middle East from starving. So what the Russians are effectively doing is creating a hunger war, or at least a hunger front in this war, and the people who will suffer, yes, Ukraine's treasury will suffer because it needs this money, but also, more importantly, in terms of suffering, is all of the Africans and the people in the Middle East whose food bills will suddenly go through the roof. Now, it may be that the Russians change their mind, but we can't assume that. So what we're looking at is hunger in one of the poorest parts of the world, and we're looking at a problem of, of, of real social unrest, in part because you've got you've got the climate crisis, you've got big heat, and you've got this hunger problem too. So um, it's a mess. All of this is a mess, and it's a mess of Vladimir Putin's making. So there is, in a sense, this war diary is aimed at people in the global south, in particular people like the South African government, which are going out of their way to play nice with Putin, and that's not good enough. I love this mural behind me. It depicts a noble warrior chopping a snake off, uh, a snake's head off. That would be Putin, of course. Vladimir Putin, do fuck off.